sun away. Last Christmas, I spent alone. And the social worker and the judges laughed at me when I asked them where he was. There are so many families here today that do not know where their children are right now. So many children suffering. And I want to ask the court today, do you care about the suffering children? Oh, hi, Do you I care did. about the fact that children are losing parents, loving parents, and that children are suffering? What, uh, whatever happened to the best interests of our children? You may say to us that some of us have had some personal issues, that we're not perfect. But if we are good parents, what else matters? Why are decisions not being made based on the best interests of children? It's a fraction of the cost to put families together with the needed services compared to the extreme cost of these courtrooms, of the 15 people that you see employed to keep children away from their parents. It makes no sense whatsoever, and most people do not understand that their tax dollars are being wasted to harm the future generation in a way that undermines the entire society. This is an insane system that must change. We insist on being heard. We insist on being discussed, having all of these topics discussed with like-minded, reasonable people. Mothers and grandmothers should be your councils of people to figure out what to do to not waste millions of dollars a month to remove children from these homes with the loved people that can help them. Instead, put them into foster homes where everybody suffers more and society is suffering at this waste of tax money daily, weekly, yearly. It goes on and on and on and we're done with it. Monica McGuire, everyone, from the Santa, Clara, Santa Cruz County Coalition. We are proud to have her, we're proud to stand by her. I am proud of everyone here for standing up for what is right. It is not easy to fight against injustice. But we will not be silenced. We are not going away. We demand change, we demand justice, and we demand that an end to our children's suffering. Why has Erin O'Doherty not seen her daughter in four years? Why was she not offered visitation? Why has Dana Barron been ordered no contact with his child based on false domestic violence? The system destroys families, destroys people, and then when we fall apart and we struggle with the trauma, the system points at us. Look, look at them, they can't, they can't hold it together. We are here today to tell you that we are holding it together and we have come together and we are not going away. You can arrest us, well, me. They don't want to be arrested. Well, might as well go for me, man. Actually, this is all Scott Larson's fault. We are not going away, and we are not scared. If you take down one of us, money more will show up at our place. Wait, 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 Patricia Lucas. When we started out, when I started out in San Francisco, there were just two of us. And then in Contra Costa County, when we started out, there were 15 of us. Now look at how many of us are here today. This is the strongest coalition I've ever been blessed to be a part of. Every, each and every person here today is a leader in their own right. Representing another Representing. people. We each represent at least three dozen other people unable to take time off of their work and other life that requires too much of us for, for us to have been too strong at this point yet, but we are getting stronger in numbers every day. You need to understand, we need to show you that we're, we, you gave us nothing else better to do. You took away our rights and our abilities to parent our children, so now we're working, sticking up for all children. That's right. Each of us represents an entire coalition. Each of us represents an army. We've started out all individually with nothing, and together, we've come together 
and represented hundreds of people behind us. And we will come back here one day, and so someday soon, we're going to come back strong. So we are, we are demanding change in the Santa Clara Family and Justice Center. I want you to look around. And, I want you to look around and make it right with these people because these people will be the end of you, Santa Clara County. Do you want to talk a little about those people? Okay. I am with Scott Logic. <laughs> I have a megaphone and I am with Scott Logic to rest him. <laughs> I didn't do it. <laughs>